We're now at the Division of Applied Thermodynamics and Refrigeration. Most of the research we do here is connected to heat pumps or refrigeration equipment. And as uh, you may know, this type of equipment consumes about 15% of all the electricity which is produced in the world. So if we can only enhance the performance of this equipment by a few percent, this makes a big difference. So how can we make this type of equipment more efficient? Well, in the heat pump or refrigeration equipment, we are operating between two temperatures. And if we can decrease the temperature difference between these two sides of the system, we will enhance also the performance, the COP. And this can be done by enhancing the performance of the heat exchangers. So in our lab, we are working with a porous structure which can be applied to an evaporator surface, which enhances the heat transfer by a factor of 10 or up to 15. And by this, we can reduce the energy demand of the system in which this evaporator is a part by about 10%. Another way of decreasing the energy use of a refrigeration equipment or a heat pump is to use microchannels. And we are also developing here heat exchangers with microchannels. Microchannels also have the advantage that the amount of fluid which is needed in the system is much less if you use microchannels than ordinary sized channels. So we get both better performance through better heat transfer and also reduced amount of fluid inside the systems. And the fluid, the amount of fluid in the system is important because uh, in nowadays we still use HFCs or so-called soft freons which have a very high global warming potential. And if we can design systems with low charge we may use ammonia or propane or other hydrocarbons instead of this HFC refrigerants. So we get both better performance in terms of heat transfer and also less release of global warming gases. The research we do here at our division is unique in the sense that there are very few laboratories worldwide specializing in refrigeration and heat pump technology. And we really think that we are one of the best divisions or departments worldwide in this area.